this moment in time where our path has crossed and our destinies are now intertwined. I'm Elder Michael Johnson and it's an honor to be in your presence. As I speak these words, I can sense the uncertainty in your hearts and many feeling the this falling into this deep abyss where the truth seems to be inclusive. The darkness overwhelming, but fear not, you are not alone. You see, you are here for a reason, a purpose. You may not yet comprehend, but one has been calling out to you, urging you to seek the truth and wake up from your slumber that has held you captive. And yet, in this irony, in this situation, for though we are physically clothed and the truth that we seek is far from us, it lies beyond the realm of our senses, of our comprehension, and can only be found through faith. But do you believe in faith? If not, I understand. It's a concept that many struggle with and I myself once grappled and I found myself the same way before I found who I was looking for. But let me tell you why you're here. You're here because you, you know something, something that you cannot explain, but you can feel it in your entire life. A calling, a yearning, a feeling like there's something more to this life that being needs to die. The feeling that has brought you here at this very moment. And do you know what I'm speaking of? Do you know who called you? And what you have opened? Do you want to know what's required of you? Then, my friend, listen closely. The one who calls you is the God of Israel, who is everywhere and all around us. He is the very air that we breathe, the ground we walk on, and the lights that illuminates our path. But there's another world that we're in, a world that blinds us to the truth. It's a prison for our minds and bodies in bondage. And it's called flesh, that we was born into a prison that we cannot smell, taste, or touch. But it holds us captive. To see the truth, we must go beyond the world of men and their philosophies and theologies, but we must turn to the book, the Bible, and its precepts, which reveals the truth that has been hidden from us. But I, I warn you, once you see the truth, there is no turning back. You must be willing to leave behind the world of darkness and step into this light, which is filled with knowledge and goes deeper than you can imagine. I offer you an opportunity freely, without cost or obligation. It's up to you to decide whether to take this step or to turn away. But if you stay, I will show you who called you. I introduce you to the one who called you out of this dark into this light. For I too am a servant of his. And it is a joy and honor to welcome you on this journey and to discover the transformation that you've been looking for.